here with Hofstra softball head coach Theresa Anderson following a loss to James Madison in the championship game. Obviously a tough day, coach. What are your thoughts? I'm, I'm just absolutely so proud of this group. Um, they competed. They gave everything they had to the very, very end. You feel bad for the seniors. You know, their last game, you hate to see someone's career end um, and that they got to hang up the cleats. But I am just so unbelievably proud of this group. Overall, the season has had its ups and downs. What have you seen from the pride and their resiliency throughout the course of the 2017 year? They, they fight. They do. They're, they're never out of the game. They have so much heart. Um, and commitment to this program and to each other and to this team and, and they fight to the very end and they give everything they have all the time and you can't ask for more as a coach. You got your seniors in all at once except for Jess Pesak who got the win last night. You had Christine Sinecori get almost a home run which is almost out of here. You had Lacey Clark end the game. What have you seen from your seniors over their years with the Pride? So much loyalty and pride for this program and for this university. Um, their work ethic and their dedication to the program is unparalleled to anything I've ever seen and we're really going to miss them and they've left, a, they've left a lasting legacy. Eight new members for the Pride. You make it back here for the first time since 2015. What did you see from your new members also? They know what it takes and now they have a little taste of the championship game, especially having eight new players on the team and you know, I, I know that tomorrow they're going to get back to work and they, they're going to want to be back here and want to regain the title. And finally, looking ahead, what can the Pride do next year in order to return to the championship? <laughs> Yeah, it's a slow down, man. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> it's you know, thing in a lot, a lot starts in the circle. You know, our, we have two freshman pitchers, and they know exactly what they need to work on. So they're going to have to continue to do some of the things that they need to do to continue to get better. And then we got to build the team around them. we got to play solid defense, and we got to have strong hitting all the way through the lineup. Right. Thank you, Coach. You got it. Thanks, Coach. Yeah.